everybody. It's January the 24th. It's my birthday. I uh, headed to up to my orientation for um, well let's cut that. Hey everybody, it's Eric Taylor, headed to Northern Indiana again, Goshen, uh, to do uh, my orientation for dynamic transport. Uh, today's January the 24th, it's my birthday, so I get to spend the day driving. Well, it's only a six hour trip but they're, they are supposed to be getting one to three inches of snow, so um, I figure it will take a little bit longer. But anyway, uh, just letting you know that I'm going to, uh, it's a two-day orientation. I may try to, I know they probably won't let me record any of it, but just to kind of let you know what's going on tomorrow morning, I'll have to be, uh, they were wanting you to go to a um, clinic there to get uh, a drug test done at 6 a.m. So I have to report there at 6 a.m. And then after that, I go do the, uh, what I'm assuming is the truck test, uh, where they check out make sure you have all the equipment that you need. And I don't know if you'll have to do a driving test or not. Some of them make you do that, some don't. Um, but hopefully I'll do a video in the future while I will showing everything that you need. Um, I still have to do the video of everything in my truck. I am going to do that. The weather conditions have not been good though, so I didn't want to get out in the real cold weather. And, and then the, yeah, I was going to do it yesterday, but the wind was blowing like 20 miles an hour, so you probably wouldn't be able to hear me. So. Anyway, I will post some more videos on this trip. Uh, maybe I'll show this what I've got in this truck too. Okay, we'll talk to you later. Okay, I thought I would just kind of move this camera around in my truck while I'm driving here. There's no traffic. I'm still in Kentucky and this highway has hardly any traffic, so um, I don't know if I'm going to narr narrate it or not. I'm just going to show you what it looks like. Of course, my GoPro goes there. I've got where my phone uh, sets. It's hooked up to the uh, Wii Boost. And then I have a reverse uh, camera. And then of course my iPad, and my drinks there, coffee and water. And then down in the floorboard, if you can see over there, I have a power unit um, that I use sometimes and just other stuff. And I have a refrigerator or refrigerator there that's powered by a cigarette lighter and that's 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 something i would advise you to get and then in the back is all my stuff for i'm staying in a hotel room tonight so it'll be a little easier Actually, I'll be there for the next two nights for sure. Maybe another one. Okay, that's it.
Well, good morning from Goshen, Indiana, where today the high is right now, which is 20 degrees, will be one degree tonight, high of 10 tomorrow, so seems I picked the coldest day of the year to come up here, so we will see. Okay, it's 5.15 a.m. We're in Goshen, Indiana, getting ready to go, well, have some breakfast and coffee and stuff, but at six, we have to be at the clinic to do our drug test. And then after finishing the drug test, we go uh, to dynamic transport to start the day of orientation, I think. I believe they're going to start out by checking our trucks out to make sure that, uh, and I say our, I'm assuming there's going to be more than just me here, um, uh, make sure we've got everything we need uh, for hauling. So that's where I'm at and we will talk to you later today. is over with I uh, had an opportunity to grab a load of course after orientation you, they'll let you take a load but I came down with some kind of real bad head cold and stuff and I'm, I just didn't feel like taking a load so I'm just headed back home right now <clears throat> and I apologize I didn't get to record more I don't know what it was but I just got last two nights it's been bad trying to sleep with the coughing and congestion and stuff so I thought better I go home but anyway the orientation went well it was two days they probably could have done it in one day um, but basically they just go over everything <clears throat> that you need to know uh, about how to fill out their paperwork and or how to fill out your uh, log books for logging your time in the trucks and, and uh, dispatching stuff. And then we did, uh, they do truck inspections. And then we did uh, this morning because it was so cold here. It was one degrees this morning. They, Instead of driving, they just had us show that we could hook up to, uh, in my case, I've got a fifth wheel and a regular uh, hookup for a regular trailer. So I had to show how to do hook up both of them. And basically they just wanted to make sure you knew how to hook, hook the trailers up, uh, campers up. And really that's all it was to it. It's really not much to orientation. Um, I have to say that they were a lot more thorough than my horizon orientation. It was kind of bang, 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 go to your, go get you a load and basically you learn everything as you go. Well, this, they, they give you a lot more info here uh, with dynamic. And I, it was okay and I enjoyed it and got to meet some good guys. And, gonna try to hook up at some other time and haul loads together so it seems to be more of a family atmosphere so um, and I talked to a couple other drivers for them uh, that just randomly came in uh, to the offices there and one of them was from Tennessee and he was telling me about uh, how the family atmosphere 
is there and you know if you break down somewhere they're right on it to get get you help versus another company he was with left him stranded so I feel it's a good company uh, I'm hit on my way home I may show some more video on the way home uh, so and we'll just uh, I'll do some more videos later in the week hopefully I feel better so we'll talk to you later